It's not like we even missed a beat. It was like at the fact that all of this is going on, but yeah, he came in and he kind of like settled it down and got everything together and was able to handle it with such calm and ease and then, you know, get us to 3-0 and for a coach to come back. As you've had to, you've had a lot of things to deal with, right? You got finals going on, you got this, this yeah. cr crazy coaching story to deal with, <laughs> trying to get ready for a bowl game. Some of the guys are graduating on Sunday. Mm -hmm. uh, how has it been actually more stressful since the regular season ended? Uh, it's definitely been hard, you know, trying to balance everything and uh, time manage everything and just, you, you know, you got people in your ear asking you, like, what's going on, what's happening at Ohio State, and then you're all, you have to, like, kind of shut that down so you can study for finals and everything. So, I mean, it's, I want to say it's as stressful as the season, but, I mean, this last month or so has been, it's definitely been tough. Nice. Has, yeah, has there been any change, has there been any change in the last week in the way that anything around here is Run or handled? No, sir. I, I, nothing. Nothing from my end, at least. I mean, it's still the same way it was last year. I mean, with all the information, I mean, he's still around. Uh, Coach Meyer is still talking to us every day. So, how much know, from what you learned about Coach Day in the preseason? How, what do you expect at all, if anything, will change heading into the spring and the next year? Um, I just. I just like seeing him from the way he handled us in the beginning. I just know that he's going to be a, like he's the perfect guy for this job. I know that he's going to take this team. I don't think anything's really going to change here. I feel like we're just going to keep keep getting better each and every year, especially with a guy like him. And he's just I think he's the right. He's definitely the right guy for the job. You guys want to win every game you play, and especially the bowl game. Yes, sir. But Urban Meyer is only going to coach in one last game at Ohio State. Mm -hmm. What's the mindset heading into that and, and sending him out a winner? We're going to send him out the right way. I mean, def definitely, uh, def definitely believe that. We're going to make sure that whatever we have to do, we're going to cherish these last couple of months with him. Uh, last month, actually, with him. And um, we're going to make sure we send him out the right way and make sure that he knows how much we appreciated him as our coach. Is that something you guys have talked about? Sending out um, coach the right way? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, we definitely, like, after we heard everything that was going on and we had a team meeting, you know, guys in the locker room, we started talking to each other and we were definitely, we just know that we're going to send the coach out the right way. With that said, this is a good football team you guys are playing. I mean, they're ranked ninth in the country. Yeah. They got a stout defense and uh, they'd love to ruin your party. Yes. I mean, talk about them. Yeah, they are definitely a good team. Definitely a team to prepare for. You know, our number one goal of the Rose Bowl, besides sending coach all the right way, is winning the game. So, I mean, we're definitely full focus toward uh, Washington, even with everything going on.